As an artist, I really admire the perseverance and determination that uh, Lee Kuan Yew had in him. And I've always uh, strived to be someone who doesn't give up easily, especially when it comes to my art. No matter how tedious or time-consuming, I just have one goal in mind, and that is to produce a piece of work that I can proudly call my best. I've also learned to become an artist who stays true to myself and my style of art. Lee Kuan Yew also inspired me as a person as well. Growing up, I've learned that not all human beings are born equal. However, I've come to see all we have as gifts and all we don't as opportunities to become better. When I begin on this piece, uh, some of my ideas come from, uh, from parts of Singapore. As we see like the past 50 years, how we came from the beginning to here, uh, it shows that like, lots of us like, put in lots of hard work in this piece of uh, what we call our homeland. Uh, about approximately 2 meters uh, wood plank and uh, like, a few thousand nails. So I have to like, get it like, through an overseas uh, distributor. This artwork is mostly based on for myself. Uh. Although I'm born here, but uh, I'm not really uh, True, true blue Singapore, as most people would say. I feel Singapore is a really a quite unique place. Really, is, they are from every country and they just come together like as one uh, to build this place up. So it's quite inspiration, inspiring for me to create this artwork. Mm, initially, uh, I started this artwork is just for myself, uh, like to create something, a uh, different medium. It takes quite a lot of time, uh, like patience and effort to do in this piece, like I will spend like maybe over 100 hours on this piece already compared to my other artworks and this the most uh, tedious work I ever done. Uh. While doing this piece I also find it's quite quite fun. I uh. actually you learn a lot of things like for every movement of treading right it takes time and thinking how you gonna move it to the next move. I will name it as um, vision from far apart when you see this piece right is you can see uh, our forefather, he's looking like ahead. And when you step closer and you try to uh, see every thread, uh, every single uh, detail of the piece, uh, you start to wonder, like, why is it so blur to your mind? Because the thread is everywhere. You couldn't see a bigger picture of it. It's because sometimes there, there, there are things that we can't see. And I chose uh, some of his younger pictures yeah, to show that uh, there's a lot of energy in him like, to portray like, a success, a uh, young man with lots of dreams and success. Lots, and, lots of effort also need to be put in and just have to keep trying and trying like, so that uh, one day um, I will be successful like him too.